hello guys welcome to the channel i am beats by manuel so today's tutorial is going to be very short and simple because i want to get out of here right now so here's what i want to do so i have this um midi keyboard right in my studio right my home studio right now uh the problem with this um keyboard is that when i load f studio um i have to start linking um the pitch controller and the mod wheel you know every single time it doesn't just synchronize with the effort studio it just i have to do that every single time before i start a single project so um, i want to fix this in case you're having these issues with me also so i'm going to show you how to fix this permanently okay you don't have to start linking every time every single time you open effort studio so without wasting much time please like this video subscribe to the channel comment if you want to yeah you should consider subscribing to the channel please so um i'm going to show you what i'm talking about right now. so i'm going to open effort studio right now see when i move those it shows the um green um color with the question mark on it um i'm gonna show you how to fix this permanently all right here's the um, first way to fix this it's very simple uh you have to move open this click here current project once you click there click current project and you want to look for for remote um control remote um control that's what you want to look for click on it so there's something you want to look at for all right so this is a um, mod wheel wrapper after touch wrapper and channel pitch wrap just channel just channel pitch actually sorry um so what you want to do is simple this is for your modulation wheel and this is for your um pitch wheel um modulation wheel now move your modulation wheel so as you as you see uh when i move that so it has actually synchronized if you look at the top left corner of your screen you can see it just it has actually synchronized with um effort studio um so we're gonna do the same for um the channel page i'm gonna move it right now you can see when i move it you can see you can look at the left top corner of your screen ah uh, yeah so it's working but here's the catch when i close it first studio and open it back again you can see it still shows um the question mark all right so i'm going to show you the easy way to fix this so that you don't have to link it up every time you open air force studio so here's what i'm going to do so um i want to link it up again so mod wheel so mod wheel you move your mod wheel okay um channel pitch move your channel pitch it's working fine so what you want to do is save this okay save us all right so you want to move to um this pc yeah my drives are full program files image line f studio 20 um i think data then templates so um so what you want to do is you can save this under um any you can create a new folder so i'm going to create a new folder and i'm going to name this um let's say let me name it keys all right let's name it that keys so I'm gonna open this. I'm gonna save this as keys. All right. So now, as just to confirm, our mold wheel and pitch wheel are working perfectly. So now, now I've saved this. What I want to do is simple. Let's just close this first. Let's close this. And let's open the first studio again. So um, let's go back to um general. this is keys all right so you click keys this is going to be your default um template so startup um project is going to be default understand so that's all you need to close as you can see it's not working all right i'm moving my mod with an pitch wheel right now it's still not working so but when i close this 
and load the FX video back again. When I move it, you can see it's working because it's not using um the template that I have saved. So this is the fix. This is the easy fix. There's no other fix, or oh, unless you get a new keyboard or other fix that I haven't known about yet. But this is gonna help you. Alright, so uh, I am Beats by Manuel. Thanks for watching this video and please subscribe to the channel. Okay, it's amazing that you watch the video and not subscribe to the channel. I am hardly touched, honestly. So, um, I'm gonna see you in the next video. So, bye for now.